thinking something better coming, I'ma wait for it. But my patience running thin, better run for it. Heartbroken in the whip, seen in all the chorus. Driving down 76 with the window down. Never listen to our parents, wish I did it now. Mama told me play my cards, better wash it out. Never trust another woman, never run your mouth. Time is running out. Black ticket for this system, know they tryna hold me down, nice and suspended. I'm still mobbing round the town, getting high and wasting time until the repo takes me down. Chalking up another line, feeling numb to every sound, that's how I like it nowadays. I wanna open up my eyes, I'd rather sleep away the day. If I'm awake, I'm getting fried like a crispy chicken leg. Put some icing in my eyes, go to grandma's talk about the good times when life was all the dream. Hi everyone, this is John, I'm in LA. Um, a while ago I made this video uh, going around LA just photographing um, art deco buildings and architecture design um, with a film camera and on the last photo in the video um, I photographed this tunnel that's been here since the 20s or uh, it's a series of tunnels but um, the closest one I could get to on foot uh, I wasn't too satisfied with the photo. I mean, I liked it enough to do the picture, but you know, it still is like, I know I could do this better somehow. Um, Cause when you drive through these tunnels on the 110 freeway, um, for the longest time, the best view I could find of these tunnels was while you're driving or on the freeway. And traffic here is pretty crazy. So you'd be stupid to uh, go out on the actual road and you know, you'd be a pancake or a confetti or something like that. So I'm not going to do that. As much as I like a good photo, I'm not going to do that. Black double dog, dare you? No, it was serious. Anyway, as I was doing that first photo, I always noticed along the sides there's all these walkways, but I just thought they were from a bygone era and they're fenced off and they don't really go anywhere. Um, I came a second time and actually made it to one of the walkways, and it was a great view of the tunnels, but there's all these signs in the way, you know, five freeway this way, uh, exit this way, and all that kind of stuff. But it was blocking the view and just made the photo ugly. So I, I came back, I just went away feeling like there's gotta be a way to do this. And so as I was just browsing on YouTube, I found this place called the 110 Walkway. And I was like, 110 Walkway? Because this is the 110 Freeway. And just a disclaimer, I'm from California. We say the 110, the 5, the 55, you know, unashamedly. Anyway, so there's this uh, walkway that goes along the portion of where the tunnels are. And they're from the bygone era when this place was built, when uh, most cars were going, you know, 30 miles an hour and a lot less traffic. So there was pedestrians going by. So anyway, as I was, I thought, you know, I got to go check this out. So I came and you get like a front row view of the tunnel and you can see the series of tunnels and it's like, this is what I've been waiting for. It smells like somebody's smoking weed. So I don't know if there's any photos you've been after that you just haven't figured out how to get to. Um, anyway, I found it for me. So I'm doing a long exposure because I don't want to just get frozen cars. Um, I want to blur the lines. It, cre it creates a nice leading lines into the tunnel. So I'm framed up with a 50 millimeter. Um, I'm just focusing on the, the tunnel itself. Um, I'm shooting at F10, just over half a second. Two second timer. What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> so for this next photo, I switched to my 70 to 200 and I zoomed in at 200. Um, Cause what, one thing I really wanted to show was there's a series of tunnels and um, there's about five tunnels, I think all together, four or five. And um, they're about hundred feet apart from each other. And so that looks really cool when you're driving through it. <coughs> so I zoomed in at 200, framed it with the, the tunnels further, further down. And with the lane right here and the traffic, it creates a nice like S shape. I see, an, I see an S shape. So one thing I try to do with long exposures, um, 
So it's, there's no, nothing's consistent with the, the traffic. I'll take several shots and just pick my favorite. And one thing I can do in Photoshop is, um, if I like a bit of this one and a bit of that one, I can merge them. And it's the same shot, essentially. Um, just more tailored to how I, I prefer it. So I have it set to F11 at two and a half seconds, um, just to create a nice blur with the light, the car lights. That's it for now. It's a short video. Um, I'm excited because I got to get uh, this photo I've been looking for for the last year and a half, um, front row and center. And so I'm excited to share these photos with you. Um, I'm planning to come again during daylight or sunrise because um, it's this perfect angle for when the sun hits it. But for the next week or so, it's, we have a cloudy forecast. So it might be a little while. Um, anyway, if you have any comments or questions, leave them down below. Feel free to subscribe. Uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.